All right, now let us quickly look at uh, family, religion and moral parem. One to look at conflict and conflict management. But today I want to focus on conflict, on, it, on conflict, then we look at management. Later, farem, conflict and conflict management. This is our topic today, right? What we were talking about last time, we remember when we were talking about responsibilities, uh, children's responsibilities, rights and wrongs, even the and parents' responsibility. Now, let us quickly look at uh, conflict. What do we mean by conflict? A conflict is a disagreement of two or more people. If you don't agree, it means there is a conflict there. Conflict exists among people since people have different opinions and ideas. So you find that people have got different opinions, they've got different ideas. So they have conflicts because you have your own opinion, someone else has his or her own opinion, so you don't agree. The moment you start disagreeing, you have caused a conflict. It is something we cannot run away from or avoid. We have to find ways of managing it so that it does not develop into wars and hatred. There are some conflicts which have good results, depending on how they have been handled. So we are saying this disagreement, there is no way we cannot, uh, we can avoid them. At one time or another, people will come to disagree on something. So the only way is for us to find a way to manage, but you cannot run away or avoid conflicts, which are disagreements, right? We have different conflicts. Uh, we may have a family conflict. because we say charity begins at home. So at home, we that is where we find we have got many conflicts, many disagreements because of different ideas there. Right, conflict may arise when people are jealous of each other. Also gossip, also the failure to communicate well lack of trust and when people are greedy. Also, there is what we call selfishness, where one is one of the causes, selfishness. When someone is selfish, thinks of himself, now that is also could be the cause of a conflict. Selfishness refers to the behavior of someone who is concerned with his or her interest only. You don't, uh, you are not worried about other, others' interest. It is always you. If you are okay, you don't mind how other people feel. That is being selfish. Let us listen to a story about a Peter who was selfish. And because of this selfishness, conflict was caused. This story is about the Kyo family. Mrs. Kyo passed away leaving four children behind, two boys and two girls. They, left, they were left behind when their family, when their parents passed away. Right. They left behind some cattle, goats, 
a grinding mill, money in the bank and a house in one of the cities. The elder brother, Peter, was very selfish. The rest of the family and even those of the distant family members did not like him for that. He would sell some cattle and use the money carelessly with some friends. He would not even pay fees for his three siblings. He would not even share with his two sisters. Chipo, the elder sister, would sometimes quarrel with him because of that. The money he got from the grinding mill was under his control. When their parents died, they settled for a room each since their parents' house in Seke had four rooms. They put some tenants, also known as lodgers, so that each and everyone gets money to help himself or herself. Peter would collect money from the grinding mill and use it to travel to Harare. He would collect rentals for the four rooms pretending to be representing the other three children. He would then spend the money by himself. The other three children, Chipo, Sam, and Ashley, including some relatives were not happy about Peter's behavior. This caused the conflict in the family. So, can you see also selfishness? He is the elder brother. He has to look after the three siblings, but he is selfish. He thinks of himself. He doesn't think of the other three siblings. Their parents died, they passed away, but they left them some cattle, they left them some goats, they left them some animals which were supposed to take care of them. They also had a, a house where they had to put people to rent so that at the, by the end of the month, they would collect the rentals and then those rentals would, uh, the money would uh, help them pay fees, the money would help them buy food, but Peter would go collect the rent, uh, doing as if he is representing the family, but instead of buying food for his siblings, instead of paying fees, he would just squander that money with his friends. So that also caused the conflict because they had now to struggle, they had to argue. Where is the money? We don't have food, we don't have fees. So that was the other cause of the conflict. All right, now I want you to quickly answer these uh, sentences using true or false. I hope you were listening. I'm just uh, concerned about our network is not stable. In the story, the cause of conflict was selfishness. Is this true or false, Rice? What do you say? The story which I have read, you heard the cause of conflict, was it? because of selfishness. Is this true or false? Price? Price, can you hear me? Can you hear me, Price? Price is nowhere to be found. Ayanda, is it true or false, Ayanda? Ayanda, is it true or false, Ayanda? Ayanda, can you hear me? You, Brave, can you hear me? 
Is it true or false? Yes, ma'am. You can hear me. True. Yes, it is true. It the cause was self. It was selfishness. Peter was selfish. The elder brother was same. Is it true or false? The elder brother was same. Angela, is this true or false? It is false. Yes, it is false. Who was the elder brother? Yes, Angela. Peter. Yes, Peter was the elder brother. Yes. Besides the selfishness, the other cause of conflict is kindness. Is this true or false? Luanda, besides selfishness, the other cause of conflict is kindness. Luanda, is this true or false? Luanda. Can you hear me, Luanda? Please, may I hear the answer? Unmute Luanda and tell us the answer. False. Yes, it is false. Very good. Because falseness doesn't, if, uh, uh, sorry, not falseness, kindness. If you are kind, there won't be any conflict. All right. Mr. and Mrs. Close house was in Seke. Is that true or false? Arnold, can you hear me? Arnold? The house was in Seke. Is this true or false? Yes, ma'am. Is it true or false? Uh, that is the true. answer. Yeah. True. Yes. It is true. It was in it was in Seke in Harare. All right. What is the other name for tenant? Malvin. The other name of tenant. Malvin. What is the other name? Melvin. Of a tenant. If you don't want to call the person a tenant. You call the person what? Yes. Melvin, can you hear me? Yes. What yes. name do you give the other name for a tenant? What is the other name? A sibling. No. Nicholas. Where is Nicholas? Is not a sibling. What is the other name? Nicholas. Can you hear me? Is Nicholas here? Who knows the other name of a tenant? I talked, we talked yes. about it. Yes, Arnold. What is it, Arnold? A lodger. A lodger. A lodger. Yes, very good. If you stay in a house which doesn't belong to you, you pay rent. You are either a lodger or a tenant. This is what happened with uh, Peter's house. They had put lodgers there who at the end of the day would pay them money so that they buy food, right? Name two benefits which were left by Mr. and Mrs. Clo. Benefits? Yes, Angela, one. Kettle. Yes, they would sell some kettle. That was a benefit. Another benefit, what would it be? Ashanti, is Ashanti here? The other one, what is the other one? Grinding machine. Grinding machine, yes, yes. The, the grinding is the guy where they would grind milli milli people would pay so that they will have some money. Very good, yes. 
Now, what does the story teach us about? What does the story teach us? The story, what does it teach us? We heard the story, what does it teach us? Huh? What does it teach us? Brave? Is brave here? Oh, he has gone brave. Brave, where? Not brave. brave? Are yes, you... ma'am. Yes, what does it teach yes. us? Yes, what does it teach us? Mm, to not fight. To not fight? No, who are fighting? Ashanti? What does it teach us? It us to be selfish. Yes, we mustn't be selfish. Very good. We must not think of ourselves. We have to think of others as well. To be selfish is very bad. Very good. How many children did the clothes leave behind? Ayanda, how many children were left behind? Ayanda? Ayanda, can you hear me? They have left how many children? Ayanda? How many children? What I'm saying, Ayanda, how many children? I have two All right, brave. How many children were left? And mute, brave. And mute. Four children. Yes, they had left four children behind. So those were the children who, who were uh, to be looked after. Right. These, can you tell, do you remember their names? Names of the four children? Ashanti, they were their names. Peter, Sam, Ashley, yes, and Tito. Yes, very good. Peter, Chipo, Sam, and. Ashley. Yes, very good. Today's lesson, we learned about a conflict, causes of conflict. And amongst those conflicts, we learned about selfishness. And we come, came across a family who had a, a brother and his sibling, siblings who looked upon their brother as someone who was going to take care of them after the death of their parents. But unfortunately, the big brother was selfish. He didn't think of his siblings, young Ashley, young Chipo, young Sam. He would squander all the monies, but their parents had left them in a position whereby they had money. But because of being selfish, which is bad, being selfish is very, very bad. Right. Before we end our lesson, can you tell me one other thing that causes conflict? One other thing besides selfishness? What is the other thing that causes conflict? Angela? Being greedy. Greedy. Very good. Greedy. You want everything for yourself. You don't want to share. You are greedy. Very good. Another one, Angel. Uh, Anon. 
disagreement. What causes those disagreements? That is my question. What causes the disagreement, the conflict? What causes those conflicts? Yes, Ashanti? Gossiping. Gossiping. Very good. Gossiping. If you like gossiping, lying, lies, then at the end, people argue. They are conflict. There is a hatred. Okay. That is okay. okay. Yes. I have seen, yes, uh, most of your work. Uh, I am going to mark your work. As I said, I had no electricity. My phone was in charge. But then, please, that mustn't stop you uh, uh, to send, send some work. I'm going to send some work today. Make sure you will answer correctly all the questions and then send them. Thank you uh, for the conflict. We are going to lock out and lock in. Hopefully now we won't have those challenges. All right. Bye now. Bye. 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 Yes, bye. We are coming for the lesson.